Hey guys, with Skype guest Chris Jones. VHS update time. October 25th, 2017. Wasn't able to get taste on Saturday because I was on vacation. Um, so I actually went today to make up for that. So let's go ahead and get started, guys. I got three clamshells and 19 slip covers. Well, actually, two clamshells and one cup box, rather. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. I got a total of 22 today, and when we get down to the last date, we're going to be getting to the unsealing. I have a lot of unsealing to do in this update. Let's go and get started. Our Charlie Brown Christmas. Went ahead and got this since Christmas is only two months away from today. I decided to go and get this two months early. Plus, yellow side barcode. I thought that was kind of neat. 43rd week in 1998. Nice green casing. Fun and Fancy Free, 50th Anniversary Edition. I was late on this tape until today. Finally out of this tape. Dark Sickle Label copy. May 27, 1997. So the day Brand the Movie Guy was born. Fun fact. That's pretty cool. And also has poem material, which I'm not going to show right now. The Summer House Alliance Video. This is a Canadian copy. Man Canada. Label. Full Marental label from Abasor Video, and I'm not going to take off this label, even though it does have a day and year code on it, but I'm not going to ruin it. I'm not going to ruin the end label, because I don't have any tapes with that Full Marental sticker yet, so I don't want to ruin it as of yet. Now slip covers. The shipping news. Ink label. Print date is May 22nd, 2002. Heidi. Playoffs video. Look at this. White Street F barcode. Finally have a Playoffs videotape at the White Street F. 27th of 1993. Rollerball. You guys are going to like this. Some weird reason it has a dark sticker label. I've, I don't think I've ever seen an MGM tape like this before. Either that or I'm not familiar with it. Look at this. Dark sticker label. And not only that. Look at the print date. Has it in slashes. December 30th, 2002. I wonder what that means. Yep, December 30th, 2002 is the print date. That is definitely something. That is very cool, actually. Yeah, that is actually very cool. I wonder what that means, if anything. Still pretty cool to see, indeed. And next, I got No Way Out. Two pro dates, January 24th, 1988, and January 21st, 1988. Stir Crazy, RCA Columbia. Comes in a squeeze and shake box. I don't like the squeeze and shake box, whatever it is. Yeah, I don't like the squeeze and shake box, so... I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the squeeze and shake box after I'm done showing this. Weekend Year Code's on the back, 46, Weekend 1984. Pretty cool to actually have a Weekend Year Code on it. I'm gonna go ahead and take out the squeeze and shake case. And guys, request all things of clothing you guys want me to do, and I will do them as soon as possible. Alright. There we go. Full rental from... Oh, this has this has a very funny full rental label. Look at this. Village Vidiot. Oh, that is a clever name. Look at that. That is a hilarious name, actually. LOL. Uh, no, that was... The Maid. Media. Co producing media. With uh, video treasures, actually. Yeah, it's a media tip. Look at this. Probably one of the first. Um, one of the first tapes of that label, I think. Maybe it's one of the first Avons. I can't tell if this is an Avon or not. Let me see the sides. No, it doesn't say Avon, but whatever this is. I don't. I can't tell. November 4th, 1987 is the print date. Breaking the Rules. This is a demo tape. HBO video. Tape. Print date, December 14, 1992. I know. I need to make my video real quick. I'll be, be I'll be there soon. 
Polar Express second copy. I could not pass this up when I got this. So, yeah, I had to get this. Inkable Black Reels. Um, October 17, 2005. I went and got a second copy just in case I needed it. Enough. And guys, I'm sorry that you guys can hardly even see the tapes. The lighting in my room is bad. I hope to take care of it sometime soon. I also have a bootleg copy of this as well. Wait, this actually has a UK style print date as well. It says the 5th of September 2003, aka September 5th, 2003, and put in the 41st week of 2003 for this tape. Pretty cool. The Taylor of Panama. Black Wizard Day, Jerry 15, Town 2. Black Wizard and Label. 32nd week of 2001. The last open one, phone booth. Black tape version. This one actually has a print date. February 2nd, 2004. Well, the print date in this one's not ruined. And now let's get to slip cases. I mean, now let's get to the sealed ones. Not Well, they are slip cases, but that's not what I meant. Sorry. Warner Bros. Western's release of the Outlaw of Jersey Wales. Has cheesy shield things on there. Um, you, you know, the little cheesy shield things right there. I do have some other seal tapes like that that I got today. I do have some other Warner Brothers seal tapes I got today, even though that is off topic. Well, not actually, no, it's not really off, too off topic, I don't think, because it's kind of related to what my tapes are. So actually, I don't think that was too off topic. That was off topic as I get sometimes in this video, in these type of videos. Anyways, I just um, revealed this tape. Uh, there we go. Got it back in the case. August 7, 2000. I'm going to have to check the opening of some of these and see if they have anything special. Forever Young, one of those hits. Yep. Three days after after you were born, Chris Jones. And Warner Home Video things right there. Let's go and open this one up. Check this one out. Ink label. January 15th, 1999. Barbarians at the Gate demo tape. HBO video demo tape. Extremely rare. Also covered with Rastar. That's a cool one. Go ahead and open it up. Alright. Oh, looks like we have a day and year code and a print date on this one. Oh, that's a this is a cool one. Stick a label. June 2nd, 1993 is the print date, and the day and year code is the 111th day of 1993. So let me look that up. Real quick on my laptop that I got for my birthday. 111th day, 111th day, 1993. April 21st, 1993, so the two print dates on this are June 2nd, 1993, and April 21st, 1993. I think it has two print dates. Magnum Force, Warner Bros. Hits. Huh, has Target label on there. This came from Target originally, probably. Look at that, Warner Home Video. Um, Cheesy Shield stamps as well, I mean seals as well, whatever you call them. Go ahead and unseal this one now. Label, uh, Magnum Force, re uh, and guess what? It says on there, reprocessed for stereo. December 18th, 1997. Uh, Mr. Smith goes to Washington. Look at that. Come and trust our own video holograms on there. Check out mine. Let's see what mine is. 
Well, I actually have another copy that's open, printed 32nd week in 1998. I remember that. Or, or wait, no, maybe it was the 52nd week. I, I don't recall. It was one of those two. See what this one is. Oh wow. 20th figure 1997. I think my copy is cool. Aloha Scooby Doo Kids Movie Collection. This was pretty rare. It's a Tom 5 VHS, so I had to pick it up. Look at that. Look at this one. Um, let me try to. Make it look better. Hold on. Hold on a minute. I don't know what's going on with my phone. Hold on. My phone's kind of acting up. I'm trying to get, like, my, um... Hold on. I'm trying to get my flashlight to work. Come on. Come on. It's not gonna work. My my phone's being stubborn, but it has like the like the Cheetah Shield seal right there is blue. Let me see if it works now. Let me restart my phone real quick. Let me see if it works after that. Hold on, my phone's just being silly. Oh come on, phone. This is taking forever. <sighs> Sorry guys, phone issues. I don't know what's wrong with it right now. My phone always does this to me at the at the worst times nowadays. There we go. Let's see if it works now. Hold on, Mom. Hold on. I'm making a video. Here we go. Now it wants to work. Look at that. Look at that. Blue. It's beautiful. Oh, and my phone died. Yeah, thanks, Apple. You're real nice today. My phone just died. Oh, man. Oh, well. Man, Apple. That's not going to be my next brand of phone. You know, that's off topic. Guys, I'm actually deciding that I'm actually going to use a different brand from now on. You know, that's off topic. And Claybowl Black Reels, July 20th, 2005. So, yeah, this is oh. Tom 5 VHS. Can you get the reprint, actually? I think that might be a reprint. Mm -hmm. True Crying. All right, this has no Warner Brothers um, shields on it. Go ahead and take this out. The shrink wrap. We're almost done here. Oh wait, actually there is one right here. That, that there was one. It looks like at one point. Huh. Hmm, look at this. Eight ninety nine. Um, per date January tenth, two thousand. And it comes with this. Pretty cool. Yeah. Free Domino's Pizza. That sounds pretty good. May have to order some pizza sometime this week. Didn't know it's off topic. Obviously. And. Whoa, my bad. And the last tape for the for this update, the train robbers. 
there's the um, cheesy shield thing on there. Let's go ahead and take it out of the shrink wrap now. Wow, this has the Cheaty Shield label. I wasn't expecting that. October 24th, 1995. This tape's anniversary was yesterday. Hope you guys enjoyed this update. See you guys in my next video.